Hey everybody, I'm Gokul from Restoration Brokers of America. Every client of ours is concerned about confidentiality, especially when you're thinking about taking your business to market. You don't want your clients to know about it. You don't want your employees to know about it. So how do we protect confidentiality and at the same time go find a buyer for your business, right? So at our firm, here's how we do it. So when we actually market your business, none of your information will be on the marketing materials. It will all be our offices, right? So when people call in requesting information about your business, they don't know it's you. They just know that we have a business for sale in your city or in your town or, 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 or in, your, in your state. So when buyers come in and they call, the first thing we do is have them sign a confidentiality agreement. So that kind of what it does, it tells them or they're signing legal document that says they cannot talk about the business to anybody um, uh, for about two years. All right. So that's the first thing we do. Then we also vet all of our buyers. We make sure that they got the experience to run your business if they decide to choose to buy it. We also make sure that they got the money to buy your business and the financial net worth, so to speak, uh, to kind of get us to the finish line. Then we have a conversation with them on their interest and what they're looking for. So we kind of take them through all these three stages before we release any information about your business, right? And we don't release uh, you, the information about your business to a lot of buyers. So maybe about 15 to 20 buyers um, and out of that, you're going to find an offer. So this is how we protect your confidentiality as we take your business to market.